Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to day four of five day WhatsApp class. Okay. Today topic is removing the public speaking fear. Okay. See, public speaking is the most highly rated fear after death. It's, it is the most highly rated fear. According to survey, it is the most highly rated fear. Public speaking. So when you go on stage to speak, you feel nervous. There's a perspirations uh, under your palm. Your your uh, your leg started shivering. Your hand started shivering. Okay, there's a hesitations. It's difficult to speak when you go on stage to speak. Okay, you feel nervous. You forget everything. Okay, but you want to be confident as speaker. You want to be confident like Barack Obama, okay? You want to be confident speaker. You would you you want to give uh, confidence presentations at the meeting, okay? So as we move further, let me tell you a story of a lion. You know, lion is called the king of the jungle. You know what is the reason why he called the king of the jungle? He is not. He is not the heaviest animal. You know who is the heaviest animal? It's the elephant. He is not the fastest animals. You know who is the fastest animal? That is cheetah. He is not the uh, longest animal. Giraffe is the longest animal. So he is neither heaviest, nor longest, nor fastest. But he is still the king of jungle. You know what is the reason for that? Yes. Due to his confidence and boldness, the lion is the king of jungle. In the same way, we have to build our confidence in public speaking, so that when when we move out to speak, we vibrate the ideas, we exuberate the ideas, we show the confidence, we are able to deliver our message with full of confidence, okay, without being nervous. So let me tell you a story to start with. Here is a person with the name Bob. He is a person with the name Bob. He want to overcome his stage fright. His presentation is due next week. He has to give the public speaking. He has to give the speech presentation next week. His presentation is due next next week. So he has tried all the all means to present before the audience. He is prepared well. He has read the book. Okay, on public speaking. Okay. He keep on repeating the affirmation that he is a lion, he is a brave, and he can do it. He keep on repeating to himself. He keep on saying to himself that he is a lion. He started imagining that the audience is sitting on the toilet pot, or audience is naked, or audience feeling embarrassed. Okay. So he tried all the thing, but he is still feeling nervous. He is still not confident to to address the audience. But he want to be confident, so he is looking looking for the cure. He is look, looking for the solution for the problem. The problem is that he has the fear of public speaking, so he is looking for the cure. Now he he has find the cure. He has read about the hypnotherapy. Yes, he has read the about the hypnotherapy, which include hypnosis. With with the help of hypnosis. He is he is he is going to remove his fear of public speaking. Okay, he has read that the stage performer, that is the actors and the musicians who perform on the stage, use this mental rehearse method, and they go into the positive is uh, positive trance state and visualize that the event is taking place in front of them. So they stop the negative talk which is going in their head and imagine the positive talk in their head. They imagine. That they are giving the speed, they are giving the speech, they are going for public speaking. They are, they imagine, they are standing on the stage and giving the speech with full of, full, with, with, with full of confidence. Okay, so he started practicing hypnotherapy to remove the fear of public speaking. He started taking deep breath. On count of three, he started taking deep breath, and on count of four. He started exhaling. So he started inhaling and exhaling. He started looking at the mirror. 
without blinking. He's he's focusing on the mirror. Soon he find his eyes. Soon he find eyes become heavy, become sleepy, become drowsier. He keep on looking at the mirror, and he can find his eyes become more sleepy, more uh, more sleepy, drowsier and heavy. Soon he close his eyes. The waves of relaxations filled his body. He imagined that there was relaxation from top of the head till down the feet. He was in deep relaxation. He was visualizing that he is on the stage giving the speech. He is imagining that he is on the stage full of audience giving the speech. and he is reading the formation that i i will thrive under pressure i will stay calm under pressure being comfortable at a stage come naturally to me i have strong nerves i have nerves of steel imagine and visualize that the audience like his speech that the audience love while he speak that the audience is cheering and audience is giving a standing ovation to him he imagined that he is full of confidence and he enjoyed giving the speech he is filled with joy because he has gift to share to the world now the day of the speech has arrived and bob is stayed calm and he enjoy giving the speech because he was sharing a special a special gift to the audience he was sharing a special gift to the world so this was a story of bob how we overcome the fear of public speaking through hypnotherapy where he visualize himself standing in front of the audience and having positive belief and imaging the positive outcome that the audience is cheering for him is giving a standing ovation for him so we can also become confident speaker when we practice this hypnotherapy when we visualize again and again around 10 to 15 times that we are giving the speech now let us visualize the speech let us imagine that you are standing in front of camera and you have to record your speech our speech is daily routine so you are recording your speech and you are with, with full of confidence and you are going to give your speech with full of confidence and with full of enthusiasm and with full of conviction so here you start your speech there are around 700 crore people living in this world and out of 700 crore people 130 crore people live in india and out of 130 crore people 31 crores are students and they have common daily routine they wake up early in the morning they take shower they have breakfast they get dressed they go to school they learn they read they write they come back they take shower they have lunch they take rest they study they go out and play they come back they study they watch television they use mobile okay. uh they have dinner and they go to bed thanks for listening to me have a nice day now after the giving the speech you must feel good because you are sharing something very important so this was this speech was very simple as this as this has been the starting point of the uh, course so in the next week we are going to do different speech with some more different with different structures and different templates okay so today assignment for you is to complete the speech okay so don't wait take out your camera and start recording the speech it's very simple speech you have to start with the opening then the main body and the closing 
आई होप यू गॉट मी थैंक्स फॉर लिस्निंग टू मी हैव अ ग्रेट डे